Let's do a problem. In an experiment, Anika connected the circuit using a 1.5 volt battery and noted down different voltages across resistance as she varied the resistance. So this is a battery of 1.5 volts and here the resistances are being varied using a variable resistor and she is noting down the voltages. Then she formed a linear equation using resistance R and voltage V and the equation she formed was V is equal to 0.2 multiplied by R minus 0.1. We have to draw the graph of the linear equation she formed and find the voltage when the resistance is set to 5 ohms. So this is the equation which Anika has formed and the variables in this are V and R and it is a linear equation since its degree is 1. Let's discuss the approach for doing this. We have the linear equation here and using this we'll be able to get the solution pairs that means for each value of resistance we will get a value of the voltage. Using the solution pairs obtained from this equation we'll be able to plot the points in the graph sheet and join the points to form the graph of this linear equation. Based on this approach, let's complete the solution. So these are the values which we have obtained for putting the value of resistance as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. In this equation, we found the value of the voltage that is 0 0.1, 0 0.3, 0 0.5, 0 0.7, 0.9, 1.1 and 1.3. For plotting the graph, we need at least two points. So here we'll take the points as 1 and 0.1 and 7 as 1.3. With these points, let's plot the graph. So this is the graph. On the x-axis, we have resistance in ohms and along the y-axis we have the voltage. We can see that the graph comes out to be a straight line. Also asked in the question was what will be the value of the voltage when the resistance is set to 5 ohms. So this will imply voltage is equal to 0.2 multiplied by value of R is set to 5 ohms minus 0.1 so this implies V is equal to 1 minus 0.1 is equal to 0.9 volts so we've made use of this formula for finding the voltage when resistance is set to 5 ohms and the voltage comes as 0.9 volts Let's summarize what we have learned from this question. To form a graph of a linear equation in two variables, it is important to form ordered solution pairs using the linear equation and plot them on a graph and join them.